we were in the midst of a terrible depression and this was a matter of getting people back to work. The government funded federal art project provided jobs for more than 10,000 artists as part of FDR's New Deal. The goal was to preserve early American art and furniture while providing much needed jobs during the Great Depression. Government had never hired artists before. Kentucky's role in this project is now on display at the Frazier History Museum. The exhibit is called Kentucky by Design, the decorative arts and American culture. This is the first time anyone has looked at a single state and how it fit in with the index of American design and what was, un again, uniquely Kentucky. Kentucky artists would canvas the state looking for artifacts to paint, to document it for the future. Twenty never-before-seen watercolors are part of the exhibit, along with handmade rugs and furniture made by people in the Shaker community. People who were in the Shaker community here, the artisans, the, the craftspeople, the woodworkers, they were all local. They didn't come from New, they didn't come from New England. They were local people. An 1814 corner cupboard made by Abraham Lincoln's father is also on display. It's really just to show the influence of the past on the future.